Hey everybody, how's it going? So today I wanted to share with you a really quick tip regarding sample libraries and contact. And it might be the most valuable tip I ever learned uh, when it comes to this. It's a real time saver and you, you know, this might be the number one thing that um, you'll, you'll be satisfied with when it comes to advice and stuff you find online. So what is this secret sauce week, as I call it? Um, it's called batch resave, okay? And essentially what this does is, is that it speeds up the loading times of your patches, whatever they are. Um, so let's let's quickly do an example here. Let's say I just downloaded Hollywood Winds from Cinesamples and you know I, I wanted to load in a patch. So let's say I wanted to load in major scales and when I clicked it, let's say it took about a minute to load, right? And a lot of even professional composers today, I see, you know, them doing walkthroughs and stuff, and then they'll click on a patch to load it in, and it literally takes like two minutes for the patches to all load in. Um, and so they're forced to ramble and talk, you know, about stuff while this is happening. So, you know, once you know this, it's going to change your life. So let's let's quickly do this. You go to this icon right here, save the floppy disk, and go to batch resave. So this um, icon will pop up, this pop, yeah, this thing here. You click yes, and then you go to exactly where you're trying to uh, save. So whichever library you wanna save, you go to that. So in this case, I'm going to Hollywood Winds. I select it, then I click open, okay? Then what the uh, what contact's gonna do is actually go to that source and save all your samples, all your documents one more time. Um, like completely save it. So now the next time you load in the library or any patch whatsoever, it's gonna load in a flash. Sorry, I can't snap with the right hand, in a flash. And so let's take major scales, for example, watch this. And there's literally less than one second. It just loaded in and now I'm good to go, okay? And yeah, that's literally it. So obviously the larger the library, the longer it's going to uh, take for the batch resave. For example, when I downloaded Berlin Strings, this library is about 120 gigabytes, I believe. And the batch resave took me the entire night. So um, I began the batch resave, you know, at 11 p.m. or so. And the next morning I woke up, it was still going. Um, it probably finished at 7 or 8 a.m. So it, this can take a long time, but if you have the patience, it's really going to um, save you a lot of time when it comes to loading in patches and not stifling your creativity, basically. So, you know, I've seen other people load in the Legato patches in Berlin Strings, which are really, really heavy. And it's it's taken up to two to three minutes. But now, because I've done the batch resave, take a look at this. And basically, you know, less than five seconds and it's done. So now I'm good to go. Can you imagine, you know, if you have a certain idea in your head and you're, you, you can't wait to get it down, and you want to load in your favorite library, your favorite patch from your favorite library, and it takes a full, you know, three to four minutes to load in. That's going to feel like an eternity when you, uh, when you're composing. In the moment, you 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 don't want to block that creativity, right? Uh, it'll feel like a waste of time. So doing this batch resaving, this is the golden nugget right there. Do this with every single library that you have. It might take a day or two, but it's going to pay off in a big way. So that's basically it. That This is the big tip, the most valuable tip. If you take something out of this channel, it, it's definitely, this, this thing is definitely one of those gems. I really, um, you know, once I found out about this, I do it with every single library and it saves me so much time, you know? So anyway, that's it. Thank you, thank you so much for watching. Uh, you know, have you had any experiences with long loading times and uh, stuff like that? You probably have before, so. You know, let me know your experiences with uh, with these long loading times, and hopefully this can you know make a difference. So, okay, thank you so much for watching. Anyway, it's a shorter video, but uh, it's really important, so I wanted to talk about it. Anyway, I'll see you in the next video. Thanks a lot, guys.